Hi, I'm Dr. Manju Davis. Because we know there are many questions and concerns in the community, I'd like to update you with the latest information on the novel coronavirus in Los Angeles County. To start, the risk of transmission remains low, and there is no immediate threat to the public. Because of the explosion in the number of new cases in mainland China, the White House recently issued a new set of directives that became effective on February 3rd. The orders mandate the following. All foreign nationals who have traveled or been in mainland China in the last 14 days are restricted from entering the United States. This order can be renewed by the President every 14 days. All U.S. citizens, legal permanent residents, and their close family members returning from mainland China are required to enter through one of 11 airports in the United States, including LAX. There, they will be screened and directed to do one of the following by U.S. Customs and Border Protection agents. If travelers show signs of respiratory illness, they will be transported from the airport to a health care facility for further medical evaluation and care. All travelers who were in Hubei province at any time in the past 14 days are considered high risk and need to be immediately quarantined and monitored at a safe location for 14 days from their last exposure. Returning travelers from other places in mainland China who have been in close contact with a confirmed case of novel coronavirus in the last 14 days are also considered high risk and will be immediately quarantined and monitored at a safe location for 14 days from their last exposure. All other returning travelers from mainland China outside of Hubei province are considered median risk and can travel to their final destination. Once they arrive at their final destination, they are asked to practice social distancing, stay home, and monitor their health for up to 14 days from their last exposure. Public health departments will follow up on all travels designated as medium risk. These new directives do not apply for people who return before the directive was issued. These guidelines are now in place and are being implemented on a go-forward basis starting from February 3rd. For more questions about screenings, visit the CDC website at the link provided. Everyone should continue to engage in their regular activities and practice good public health hygiene. Because the novel coronavirus is new, we're learning more about it each day, and we encourage you to check our website for the latest information. Public Health is working closely with federal, state, and local agencies to continue monitoring this novel coronavirus and prevent the spread in Los Angeles County. In the meantime, here's what you can do to protect yourself and others. Thoroughly wash or sanitize your hands. Cover your nose and mouth when you cough or sneeze. Avoid touching your eyes, nose, and mouth. Limit close contact with people who are sick and clean surfaces that are touched often. And if you are sick, stay away from others. Our priority is to keep you and your family healthy and informed. We will continue to provide updates as they become available. Thank you.